Hey guys, welcome back to DRX Tube. Today you read the title. This is a Martian Rover review. Alright, so if you watched my last video, Lego Roadrunner Mock, then you'd probably know I went to a museum. That museum is where I saw rockets, planes, helicopters, and the largest plane ever made out of wood. The Spruce Goose. And before we continue, I'm going to show you a montage of pictures that we took there. Starting the montage now. Man, that was fun. Okay, back to the video. So there, um, I saw this little Lego set in the gift shop, so we stopped to check it out and bought it. So let's start off with the minifigure. Okay, so onto the minifigure now. Um, it's kind of unique. Um, it, the shoulders are a bit far apart. The legs look too small. Um, the legs, behind look kind of weird um well i don't think this counts as an actual lego minifigure because um the box it came in didn't say anything about lego it was called construction bricks but who cares it's different piece it's different companies but same toy which doesn't really matter okay all right sorry um the torso looks kind of funny but it works. The head under it, it to me, it looks kind of weird. The mouth is kind of weird. Um, and these eyes, to me, kind of look weird. So I like to keep it like this. Sorry for the bad focusing. It doesn't focus, I don't know why. Okay, now let's move on to the actual rover. So the rover is pretty cool. Um, I knew the satellite dish was over here, but it was in the wrong spots. Um, there. Um, the satellite dish can move up and down, slightly side to side. Well, not slightly. It's just easy to fall off. Um, it's got this headlight and this thing. Um, these joints. Um, they're supposed to be really thick, but they are very loose. I don't know why. And another thing. This thing likes to fall apart a bunch. Oh. Okay, I got it fixed. Um, it rolls on four steady wheels. Um, at first, I thought these things were um, little like satellite dishes, but they're actually um, seats. I, I did not know there were seats at first. Um, behind the seats, we've got these square thingies if you move these out these out there's an opening there okay let it's very um easy for it to fall apart and there's this thing that moves out one of those movie things yeah the united the united states of america flag i like that and it also has this pickaxe. I like the pickaxe. Oh, man, does this ever stay together? Okay, I'll see you on the other side when I get this all fixed. There, that's better. Um, on the front, it has this little headlight. There's supposed to be one right here, but it fell off. It happens a bunch here. Okay, so yeah, that's pretty much it about this thing. Um, also, uh, this thing probably will not stay. What I mean is it's probably not going to stay together because um, I'm probably going to break it and use 
its parts for pieces because um, I don't really need this that much. And I'm low on joints, so this could help anyway. Okay, um, also, if you want to go to the place, you can search up Evergreen Aviation and Space Museum. It's a planned place. There's even a pool. We didn't go to the pool because we weren't planning to go to the pool. All right, so thanks for watching. Bye. Mm. Did you hear that? Yeah, I do. You can go check it out. Sure. Get the axe. All right. Could be something dangerous. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's an alien. Found the first signs of life on a different planet. We are gonna be famous. Wait, where'd my axe go? Hmm. Ooh. Ah! Ah, we're for your lives! Uh, just excuse me, I'm just gonna get out of here.